Hi guys and welcome back to another edition of M Chicky series. In today's video I'm going to show you how to make this pearl bracelet here or pearl necklace. This can be used as a fashion complement for any of your dressing. Maybe you have a dress but you don't have a matching neck piece for it or a bracelet for it. You can quickly make this using a ribbon and some pearls. So let's get started. First I've got my dark blue ribbon here. Then I've got my light blue pearls. I also got my mini scissors to snip off my thread. And I've got my lighter here. I will start by trimming off the edges of the ribbon using the lighter. This is to keep down the excess thread, the fray threads that are coming out so it doesn't, it doesn't loosen up quickly. Then I'm going to measure out 8 inches at each end. This can be used to form a bracelet or a necklace, depending on what you want. But if you want to form a necklace, then you make the length longer. Then if it's bracelet, you make it longer, uh, you make it shorter, sorry, according to your, your size. Using my tape, I'll measure out 8 inches at this end. This 8 inches will be used to tie it off. Then holding this place down, I'll form a knot. Then I'll start adding my thread, my pelt, sorry, using my needle. I'll go right behind the knot. And pick up one pearl. I sew it back on the ribbon. And I'll leave a space approximately half inch here. And pull my thread, add another pearl, leaving a space of half inch. Pull my thread again. As you pull the thread, it is forming little ruffles here. So I keep doing this like, till I get to the required length. So this is the same, exactly the same pattern you get when you add all the pearls. So I'll keep adding the pearls till I get to the, the length I want. I remember to keep a space of half inch because it's the half inch space that gives the ruffle when you pull it.
it is getting more and more beautiful as you add on the beauty comes out more I think the beauty also depends on the color that you've chosen if you choose bright color and match it very well with good pearl it will also be very beautiful and attractive remember this is a quick fix when you have some clothes or dresses but you've not you've got no matching neck piece you can quickly make this up and use it to rock your dress I'm coming to the end so what I'll do I'm gonna measure up another eight inches here at this end like I did in the other end this this is to leave allowance to tie up the the ribbon because I'm not gonna add any claps It's the excess ribbon that we use to close the necklace when you want to wear it you tie up the ribbon that will serve as your clip claps then I've got eight inches here and I'll tie it also I don't overshoot as I'm adding on my beads so I'll form a knot you don't need to tie it so firmly when you tie it so firmly the shape of the knot will not show because the shape of this knot also adds beauty to the necklace you have to tie it gently And I add more beads before I tie off my thread. My my thread has twisted right now, so I'm trying to untangle it okay I'll go right back I've come to the end but I'll need to tie off my thread I'll try to pass on the thread back into the knot so that when I tie nobody sees it and pull the thread firmly to get the required tension so my my pearl doesn't go off so I'll go to the back here and tie it off I tie off by forming two knots. Then I'm going to do another knot here. Then I'm going to use my 
lighter again okay my hand is slipping right now you have to be careful not to burn your ribbon and that's it this is what I've got this is my neck piece here which is like a choker because when you look at it you see it's not that very long if you want a longer one you make the length of the ribbon longer because I've got here one yard of um, blue ribbon so you can make it one and a half or two depending on what you have then I've got my pearls also which is like uh, 17 pieces I've got here so if you want to make it longer you can make it up to 25 or 30 depending on the length your neck length so this is the end of my tutorial for today and thank you for watching if you found this video very interesting give it a thumbs, thumbs up remember to subscribe bye and see you in my next video